Welcome, Apple Baseball fans. This is Philip Reynolds. This is Series 2, Game 5 of um, my Way Back Baseball. Um, this is Game 5. Um, last game, the Indians tied the series up, so the series is now 2 2. They will have to go back to Cleveland to settle it, but we are still in. Um, Brooklyn. Um, the Indians' big inning last game was the fifth inning. They, got, they scored three runs, uh, and the final score was six to four. The uh, Dodgers' big inning was the first inning. They scored two runs in the uh, uh, first inning, and they managed to score just two more runs the rest of the game. They pretty pretty much were kind of shut out. Um, tonight's lineups uh, for the Indians, we have Davis in center field, Kipnis in second, Lindor in shortstop, Napoli at first, Santana is in a new position. He's in left field and I had to um, figure out his uh, rating because he's not listed at, at the left field position. And based on the other outfielders for the Indians, I gave him a two rating um, on his, his card for the fielding a, a, a notations. Um, Ramirez is uh, at third. Geyer is in right field. Perez is in center field. Bauer is the starting pitcher. Um, he pitches four innings and he's grade C. Uh, after that, Clevelander comes on for an inning and he's a grade C with the W notation. After Clevelander comes Shaw. He's got uh, he pitches 1.1 innings, and he's a B notation with uh, Y. And then Allen finishes up the game with, uh, and he pitches 1.2 innings. Um, the Indians' fielding was 42, and after you swap out Bauer and add the other pitchers in, it still wind up to be a 42. Um, so they will be off the, uh, the, the Dodgers will be batting off of chart, chart, fielding chart one. The um, Dodgers batting lineup in their half of the, the uh, inning is Gillum, Reese, Snyder, Robinson, Hodges, Amaros, Ferrillo, Campanella, Pretty much the same kind of lineup that they've been using throughout the entire game. And Magley is in for the second time, and he pitches the whole, whole game. Um, he's a grade B with a Y notation. And uh, looking at the, the game, um, and when I went to the baseballreference.com, that's where I get all my lineups and how each pitcher pitched and how many innings each pitcher pitched. Um, that's where I get my information. And when we play the game, that's how I'm playing it. I'm playing it just like it was played. The only difference is um, because they're in, in two different eras, I'm playing the way the Indians played their lineup when they played the Cubs and I'm playing the Dodgers lineup when they played the Yankees and the big notation for game five here is this is the game that Don Larson pitched a perfect game so it will be very interesting to see if the Dodgers can win uh, against a different team in a different time era in this one. Um, the uh, other thing is 
is um, the Indians uh, clean up, clean up pitcher. He has a grade A with a K notation. That could change the uh, could possibly affect the outcome um, because the the Dodgers only use one pitcher, and um, um, he's a, a B with a Y notation. So the, the fact that the Indians have one pitcher that's really a, a top-notch pitcher, even though he's a relief pitcher, could be the difference in this game. Um, and the Dodgers fielding was a 43. And because Magley is, is pitching the whole game, it, there's no uh, change to the, the Dodgers fielding at all. So both teams are, are uh, fielding uh, will be fielding for the whole game and, and fielding one chart. The difference, pretty much, more or less, is the Indians pitching and their different grades that that, that show up. Other than that, uh, the, the game should be interesting to find out. Like I said, this was the, the game where the Dodgers were, uh, had, you know, a perfect... Don Larson had a perfect game against them, so will they win now, or will the Indians win? Um, it's time to find out who takes a 3-2 game series lead, and next up is the National Anthem. Before we start today's game, I wanted to show you my score sheet and um, show you that with the pitchers, I put their grades and their letter notations and I also have been putting their how many innings that they pitch whether it's 4 or 1 or 1.1 or 1.2 and from for Magley you'll see He's a B-Y, and he pitches the whole game. And I just wanted to show you that um, what I'm doing as far as my actual score sheet and that I'm actually keeping track of that on my score sheet. Um, all right. And with that being said... It's time for game five. Let's see who can eke out the other team and go ahead in the series. Davis is up. And that's a 26. And that's a strikeout. This is up next. Thirty four. That's a fly out to. Schneider and that's one of the things I wanted to try to do this game that I haven't been doing was actually to, to say who the um, outs are, are kind of by rather than saying just saying shortstop and third base to to you know second base type thing I just I want to try to, to get more used to actually saying the players name by the position that they played so that was um, an out to uh, Snyder the center fielder Linder the shortstop is up it's a 41 
that's that's Reese to Hodges for for um, the the last out of the inning. So that's shortstop to first base. That's Reese to Hodges. And after the top of the first, there is no score. And that will bring Napoli up in the top of the second. Gillum is up for the Dodgers in the bottom of the first. And that's a 52. Which is a 27. That's that's um, Ramirez to Napoli for the out. Five to three. Ramirez to Napoli for the out. One away. Reese is up. That is a ground out to Hodge, to, sorry, that's a ground out to, to Napoli. It's two away. Snyder is up. Fifteen. That's a fly out to center field, and center field, center fielder is Davis. All right, so after one, we have no score. Napoli's up. It's a 15, and that is a 10. Bowers of grade C. And that, my friends, is our first hit of the game. Napoli gets our first hit of the game. And that's a single. Santana is up. Now, this is where I wanted to tell you, he's a first baseman, but according to, to the, the uh, baseball reference guy, he actually played left field, and rather than giving him a three, I had to give him a two because um, the outfielders uh, for the Indians all were, were uh, uh, given a, a two marking for their fielding. So I couldn't, I couldn't give him a three. I had to give him a two. Sixty-three, and that is thirty-two, and that's a fly out to the right fielder, and the in the the. Dodgers right fielder is Farilla, so that's a uh, that's a fly out to the right fielder. That's Farilla. That's one away. Ramirez is up.
35, that's 9, and Dodgers pitching a B, that's a single and the runner, and the runner makes it the second. All right, so another single. Brings up Geyer. Two men on. Um, let's see. We're gonna try to bunt the runners to second and third. Geyer's gonna try to bunt the runners over to second and third. That's a 36, which is a 14. Uh, okay, and that just loads the bases up. So we have the bases loaded. catcher for the Indians and only one out that's a 33 and that's an 8 okay that's a um, Pop out to the center fielder, which in this case is Schneider. Okay. But Napoli on third scores. And so in the top of the second, the Indians have a 1 0 lead. And that means that Perez has a sacrifice, and he's got one RBI. And we have men at first and second. This brings up Bauer to the plate. Uh, he has to hit away, unfortunately. 23. Oh, when he strikes out. It's a shame that he has to, he has to, he had to bat because he pitched the first four innings. But it's also sad because they had uh, men at first and second. And couldn't get any more crossed. So, at the end of the top of the second, it's the Indians won and the Dodgers up to the plate. And they haven't scored yet. Okay. And Robinson is up for the Dodgers. Bauer goes back to the pitching facilities on the mound. And so 
61 is a 39. And that is is on a gray oh wait a minute no that's just a strike so we get to roll again 13 that's a base on balls 13 is a 14 which is a base on balls so Robinson wall Hodges is up is 27 and that is a double play that's um, it's third baseman which is Ramirez to the second baseman which is Kittness to Napoli uh, for a dub double play Five, four, three, double play. And that brings up Amaros. Nobody on base. Four, which is pop out to the right fielder, and the right fielder is Geyer. That's from to Geyer. We'll bring up Ferrillo in the next round. And after two innings. Our score is Indians 1, Dodgers nothing, and Davis is up to bat now. Okay. 25. That's an 11. And that's single to left, batter steals second, one strike on the next batter. So our hitter got a single, stole, and then Kipnis is up with one strike on him. Okay, runner out at first, runner to third, and that is that's Ramirez to Napoli. It's 
five three. Ramirez to Napoli. Okay. We got a man at third. And Campanella is up. Um, let's see here. Do we hit for him or do we sacrifice, try to sacrifice, uh, wait a minute. gotten there yet. <laughs> Kitten, this was out. 5-3. Okay, that's one. And he went, he stole base. And he's now at third. Okay. Okay. It makes Linder up. Winders up. Okay. Um. Yeah, Winders gonna try. To, he's, he's gonna hit. Twenty-three and twelve. Oh, that's a double play. That's um, that's run around at home, and that's put out by the catcher. So out from the right fielder, and then he threw it to the to the uh, catcher. So that's that's Ferrillo to Campanella. So that's a double play ball. That's, nine to two. that's basically nine to two. He's out going home. Third out. Right. So after After the, the middle of the third, it's still one to nothing, and Ferrillo is up for the Dodgers. Fifty-six, and that's a strikeout. Campanella is up next. Up. It's a 46. It's 24. The base is empty. That's shortstop to first base. That's 6 to 4. I mean, 6 to 3. 6 to 3. And that's Linder. To Napoli. Linder to Napoli on that one. And that puts Magli up at the plate. Fifty one and he strikes out.
So after three innings, after three innings, um, the score is one nothing Indians. Napoli up in the top of the fourth. It's 33. That is a five. And that is a double. Napoli gets a double. Santana is up. Man at second. 26, and that is a strikeout. We'll have to go to no charts for that one. Strikeout. Man at second. Ramirez up. Forty-six, and that is a strikeout as well. Brings us to Geyer. That's a 51, and that's a 9, okay, um, single for Geyer, the batter, over second, the runner scores, so we have a man at first. Right, and that was from the center fielder to the catcher, it says. What? Okay, yeah, there's no notations of an S or anything, so yeah, he scored. And so that's um, yeah. Okay. So single, runner scores, and um, the Indians are up two nothing now. And Perez is up to the plate. Man up first. Twenty six, and that is a strikeout. That's, but the Indians scored one, so the score after the end of four is two to nothing. And the pitcher spot will be up in the, in the um, fifth inning, but Bauer is taken out in the fifth. 
so they'll probably have to, to uh, yeah, Bauer is, cha uh, is taken out and replaced with Clevenger. So Gillum is up for the Dodgers. And that's a fly out for the shortstop. And that's Linder. One away. Reese is up. Fifty-five, and that is an eight. And that's a fly out to center field, and that is Davis. Snyder's up. The 16. And that's shortstop the first base. Six to three. Three up, three down. And That's Linder to Napoli. Um, so, yeah. We've got the pitcher spot due up here in the fifth. And, um, so... The Indians will have to use a um, a um, a uh, pinch hitter. So Bauer's gone, and the Dodgers will be facing Clevenger. And the keen comes up. Comes up as a pitch hitter in the fifth. Fifty six, and he strikes out. That's one away. That puts Davis up. Uh, Fourteen, that's thirty. It's a fly out to left field. Left field is. Amorous. Kipness is up. That's Reese to Hodges. Six 
three, Reese to Hodges, and that will be the end of the top of the fifth. Okay. On the mound for the the Indians this inning is Clevelander. And he pitches an inning and then is taken out. So he will pitch basically the fifth inning and he's he's uh, taken out in the sixth inning. Okay. Okay. Bottom of the fifth. Okay. Hodges is up. Oh. No, I'm sorry. Robinson is up. We read. I read that wrong. Robinson is up. Twenty-six. And that's that's Ramirez to Napoli. Five to three. One out. Ramirez to Napoli. Now Hodges is up. Twenty-four and Hodges strikes out. Amaros is up. Sixty-one, and that's a foul ball. Fifteen, that is an eight. And that's a fly out to the center fielder. The center fielder in this case is Davis. So Cleveland and Jer is gone. Shaw will be the pitcher for the Indians in the bottom of the sixth. And Linder is up for the Indians in the top of the six. All right. Forty three, that's twenty nine. That's okay. Mangley is a Y, so that does not come into it. So that's a put out by the first baseman, who is Hodges. Hodges gets that. Napoli's up. Forty-four is an eight, and that's a fly out to center field. And in this case, that is Schneider. Santana is up. Twenty-two is a zero. This is a hit. Twenty-one is a six. And that is a double. Double for Santana. Double. 
Double for Santana. Okay, and that brings up Ramirez. Ramirez. Oh, no, that won't work because there's two outs. Ramirez will have to hit. 24 and he strikes out. Trying to get a third run home, but the Indians can't do it. And if, uh, if there's after the top of the sixth inning, scores two to nothing in favor of the Indians. And Shaw is on the mound and he pitches for an inning and a third. So after the first out in the seventh, he's taken out. So, Ferrillo is up for the Dodgers. And that's out by the first baseman, and that's out basically by Napoli. Napoli gets that. Campanella's up. Campanella gets a 23, that's 24, and that's shortstop to first baseman, so that is Linder to Napoli, that's 6-3, and that puts Magley up to the plate. That's out by the first baseman, so that's out by Napoli. We go to the top of the seventh with a score two to zero. And Perez is up. Oh, I'm sorry, not Perez, but the guy here's up. Guy here's up. I'm reading the wrong guy sometimes. Guy here's up. Put Bailey back at the pitcher's mound for Guyer. 16. That's a 28. That's a Shortstop the first base. That's Reese to Hodges. Reese to Hodges. Six to three. Now Perez is up. That's shortstop to first, and that's Reese to Hodges again. Two away, and let's 
see here. So he pitched to and the bottom. So yeah, he has to pitch. He has to bat. So Shaw's batting. Unfortunately, in this situation, Shaw has to bat. Forty-five, and that's a walk. The pitcher walks. Which brings Davis up to the plate. Two is a thirteen, and that's a strikeout. So, after the seventh, top of the seventh, it's two nothing Indians. The um, Dodgers are up at the, the plate. Gillum is up, and after. After the after the first out in this inning, out Cody Allen comes up. So Gillum's up. Sixty-four, and that is a twelve. Out at first by the third baseman, so five to three. And that's Ramirez to Napoli, and Shaw is gone. No, I'm sorry. Shaw's not gone. Shaw's still. That's in the Dodgers part of the inning. <laughs> Wait a minute. No, that's right. It's all gone. Cody Allen comes in. And Reese is up to the plate. I was right the first time. That's 61 to 30, 39, and that is a strike. Twenty-five, and that's an eight. Great eight pitcher. That's a fly out to the third baseman, and that is Ramirez in this case. Snyder's up. Sixty-three is a thirty-one. Let's fly out to center field, and that's Davis. Fly out to Davis. All right. So there is no more substitutions as far as pitchers go. So Magley pitches the rest of the game, and Cody Allen pitches the rest of the game. So it's based on now how the hitters do. And Kipnis is up for the Indians.
56 is a 34, that's a pop up to the shortstop, and that's the Reese. Linder is up. Uh, 52. That's that's Robinson to Hodges. It's five to three. Robinson to Hodges. It's two away. Napoli's up. Fourteen. And that's a fly out to left field. And that's Amaros. That's a fly out to Amaros. Three up and three down for the Indians in the eighth. Still two to zip. So this could be anybody's game here. The bats for the um, Dodgers could get hot. This could be a different brawl game in a quick second. Robinson's up. 26, it's 27, and that's Third base to first base, that's Ramirez to Napoli. It's five to three. One away. Hodges is up. Sixty-three. That's a fly out to center field, which is Davis is an eight. All right, Emeros is up. All we need is one or two guys to get hot and it could be over with real quick. 25 is a nine. Out at first, shortstop to first base, and that's Linder to Napoli, six to three. All right, top of the ninth for the Indians, Santana's up. and that's a walk. Santana gets walked. Ramirez is up. That's a fly out the right field. Walk. Fly out the right field. It's nine. And that is to Ferrillo. And that puts Geyer up to the plate.
first out. So that puts Geyer up. Geyer's up. Forty-three. It's twenty-nine. Out at first. Runner to second. And that's out by the first baseman. And that's Hodges here. Raz is up with a runner at second. Fifty-three, and that's an eighteen. Um, let's see here. There are two outs. It says. First on error, it says runner hold, but for uh, a two out result, it says out at third, short stop to third base. And that's what we're doing there. So that's Reese to Robinson. And that's six to five. And that's the end of the top of the ninth and the score is two to nothing Ferrillo is up and the Dodgers need three to win so can the Dodgers get three in this ninth inning to win this game 22 it's a seven that's a single Rillo gets a single. Campanella is up. Oh, wait a minute. Sorry. I'm gonna have to. <laughs> oh, jeez. Unfortunately, since I can't remember what I rolled on that last one, I'm gonna have to re-roll that because I was looking at uh, with a man on second chart. So I have to re-roll Carillo's at bat because it's only fair because this is the bottom of the ninth, and if I gave him uh, the the single and somebody came up with a home run that would tie up the game and that would be controversial so I'm re-rolling Carrillo's roll. He's got a 35 and that's a 9 and Allen's the, the pitcher and that's out at first, that's shortstop to first. Um, and that's Linder to Napoli. So six to three. I have to I hate to do that, but it's the only fair way to do that. One out, Campanella's up. Thirty-five is a thirty-six, and that's a base base on balls. No, no, I'm sorry, that's not a base on balls. That's just a ball. I was looking at the W. The ball. Campanella again. 42, and he strikes out. So that leaves the pitcher up. And... See who we will bring in for. I 
we're gonna bring in up Ransom Jackson for the final out of the game. Hopefully not, but that's what it looks like so far. And that's a 30. That's a fly out to left field, which is caught by Santana. And the game is over. The Indians win game five by a score of two to nothing. And so the Indians take a 3 2 series lead and go back to Cleveland.